Have you ever wondered what that slimy pink stuff is that's in the bathroom? You find it in the bathtubs, your sinks, and your toilets? Well, it's most likely a common type of bacteria called Serratia marcescens, and it can be found almost everywhere, including the soil, the water, and in the air. And they feed off of mineral deposits and soap scum from shampoo and soap residue, which is why you always find them in showers and bathtubs. Serratia marcescens is not known to cause waterborne diseases, and in most healthy people, it's not harmful if you just brush up against it in a shower or a tub. However, if you, it enters the body through the eyes or open wounds, it has been known to cause ailments like urinary tract or bladder infections. And in a hospital environment, it has caused more serious issues such as pneumonia in immunocompromised people. In general, though, it's just an eyesore. It's unpleasant to touch. So you want to know how to get rid of it. First thing, scrub it off using a soft bristle brush and store-bought bathroom cleaners or a mixture of baking soda and dish soap both work. Rinse it with water. Make sure you're wearing gloves and protective gear just to minimize your exposure to the bacteria. After you clean it, disinfect the surface. Spray on a mixture of bleach and water and let it sit for about 10 minutes and rinse that off. If you have shower curtains, make sure you sanitize them in the washing machine if they're machine washable. And then make sure they're fully dried before hanging them back up in the shower. So the, it, this is important because you want to prevent the biofilm from forming again. So you want to keep the surfaces dry. Squeeze or towel dry hard surfaces like in a shower or tub. Clean them regularly. So the showers, tubs, and the toilet bowl to minimize that residue buildup. Machine wash the shower curtains, as we said. Repair the leaking shower heads or faucets, both to maintain a dry environment and to save water. Keep the windows in your bathroom closed when you're showering because the bacteria is airborne and most likely entering through an open window. And you want to run the exhaust fan in the bathroom to reduce the moisture in the air when you're using the bathroom. If you found this helpful, follow us for more helpful hints and like and share.